What's up guys and welcome to Lily and Babe's YouTube channel. On today's vlog, we are doing a much requested, highly anticipated, finally here, <laughs> Mexican playlist. So you ready? I'm ready. I'm ready too. So this playlist for me was honestly a little bit difficult because Mago and I love all kinds of music, especially Mexican. Obviously, we like corridos, bandas, um, trap corridos, trap corridos. Uh, what is that? Like, corridos tumbados. No, no, no. Reggaeton. Sax. The sax music, guapangos. Uh, what what else am I missing? Everything. Um, oldies. oldies. We love it all. We love a little bit of everything. So what I tried to do today is I pretty much put my top songs that whenever I hear them, it just gets me like a little hype, I want to say. Like it takes me back to some point in my life that was super hype too. So yeah, that's my take on today's playlist. So I hope you guys enjoy and let's get started. And just so you guys know, I'm making a quick michelada. I'm drinking. It looks fancy, right? But it's puro show. It's just a sparkling... What is it? The agua frescas I've been drinking lately. Oh, so. yeah, yeah, that's good. Are you ready? You see them madre, look. Oh my god. What chamoy you got there? I got chamoinito. Hey, okay. So basically, I'll do one of my favorites and then Mondo will do one of his and we'll be going back and forth with that. So I'm gonna start first. Ready? So one of my first songs, even Alexa knows about this song. Everybody knows about this song. If you don't know about this song, can't be friends. I don't know. It's it's an old school song, but it's just a classic. You ready? Alexa, play Carlos y Jose. This is Carlos y Jose from Armando Spotify. Hey, hey. <laughs> yeah, that song jams out. So yeah, this is the old school song. By the way, each song is only going to be about a quick three, four seconds, maybe five max, because we don't want to get copyrighted. So let's see how it goes. Pray for us. So this one right here is my jam. When I pull up on the Mamalona, this is the first song I put on. Um, Alright, I like that song too. Let me get my Michelada started here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, let it be. Let me put on another song. Alright, this next song is something that had a little bit of controversy when it came out, right? Yeah. But I love the whole concept of it. I love how we are taking different genres of music and making them together i think it's a beautiful thing for all cultures to come together but anyways enough yip yap uh this is the bad bunny with natal cano on soy el diablo yeah another song yeah that was jamming yeah my turn my turn i got oh, one here i got one i got you i got you oh i got that one on my playlist too La escuela nunca me gustó. I don't know the whole thing. So this song is a little tiny bit, a little bit, a little bit old, but it's something that I am singing it all day, every day, Every right? day, she sings that little piece. <laughs> every day, I'm getting in the car, getting off of work, doing my makeup, getting out the shower, and all of a sudden, you just hear me say that little piece that I know. So let's do it. Suéndala, suéndala. What do I say? That's the part that I sing all day every day. This is for oh. all the H-Town, Houston, Texas people right here. So this song, this song, this song. Everybody knows that I love this song because it why, was... Why, 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 why? We've said it a million times, but it was Mando and I and mine and I and mine. Okay, first dance. So every time I hear it, it's like, oh. So anyways, let's do it. So yeah, that is... That is the jam. That is going to be our song win, babe. Cuando te cases conmigo, chiquilla. Yeah, that. Okay, your turn, dale. My turn. I already see it right here. Yeah. When we saw him in concert, um, well, at the Heidi Bell, that shit was so lit. Too lit. Too lit. Too lit, I can't remember. 
Okay, let me see. My turn, my turn. Is that my playlist? By the way, that was on my playlist. All right, so I'm gonna take it back to them days where I was single and living my best life. You know? <laughs> just kidding. Uh, but this, no, not kidding. So this song is just something that reminds me of when I had my little Dodge Charger and I was whipping the streets and going out all the time and thinking I was all, you know, that. But, Bochona? Yeah, so all right, let's do it. <laughs> Here, look, try my michelada while I'll put my song on. Mm. Are you ready for this? What do you know about this? Me? What do you know about this song right here? Well, put it on. Wait, how's my michelada? It's bomb, but mine's better. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> have a little backstory to it so I here we I, go with the stories so I hope you guys can relay or it takes you back to a time in your life but this song takes me back to a time where me and my prima would be over there the locas you know you know living our single life I always go back to my single life so <laughs> I'm sorry <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna put one of my single life <laughs> no anyway so this song yeah it's just a classic that we would jam out to so let's do it <laughs> So um, this song right here is shout outs to my boys from Sexta Alianza up in Oregon. Jamming, jamming. I'm about to put y'all on. No soy de problemas, mucho menos de Respeto a quien le respeta el chico así que crea. So technically that was my song, but I'll let him claim that he found it. So <laughs> these these are like Texas songs, I want to say, right? Escapé, but yeah, escapade West. type songs, you know. Anyway, so this is a song that I fell in love with a long time ago, and I still like it. Apaga tu celular. No quiero que se le ocurra saber dónde está. Alright, so this one right here is an old school classic. Not so old school, but old school for me. Um, shout outs to Valentina Elizalde, rest in peace. Terminar como amigos. Que se como enemigos. Let me find out. Let me find out you're trying to tell me something. Okay, so this song got a lot of controversy back in its day, but I don't care. I still got lit to it. Um, I don't know if it's the beat, if it's just making me feel some type of way or what it is, but... We are ready. Good job, good job. <laughs> We're so, Your turn. We look buchones. <laughs> All right, my turn, my turn, my turn. They have it, they have it. Como de costumbre, navego en la lumbre. So this is one of the newer songs that I have on repeat all the time. También. So yeah, once she likes a song, she'll play it all day, every day. For a million like three freaking, months. and I won't ever memorize all the words. I used to. No, when I was no, younger. even worse, the name of the song. Oh, no yeah, I don't even it. memorize the names. <laughs> but, anyways, I, I'm like, babe, what is that song I like? It says Malo something, Malo, Malo this. And he's like, this Frutola Malo, babe, for the 80 million times. <laughs> Whatever, you're just gonna have to deal with me for the rest of your life. Okay, wait. Ready? <laughs> One of my faves right now, current faves. I'm not girly at all when it comes to my playlist, right? Alright, so this song right here gets me so lit. Check it out. So this song it is a little bit uh, more on the 
lovey dovey side? Lovey dovey, kind of, sort of. But it does take me back to the time when I had friends. You didn't have friends no more? And a Vanessa, y'all know what I'm talking about. That would go out all the time. And um, this song, every time we heard it, every we went to go see him in concert, it was just like a chorus because we would not shut up singing this song. You ready? This is my favorite part. All right, this one right here, no me la sé muy bien, but it's just, this is the jam. This is the jam lately. Wait, right. this is for my place. The next song is, I think it's a new classic for a lot of us mm -hmm. um, millennials. And what's the other one? Babe, what's the ones after us? I don't even know. Generation X. And Gen X. Um, but yeah, if you guys haven't seen this vlog and we went to go see him, please go watch it. We'll actually add the link down below if we remember. So this one right here is a classic, a modern classic I want to say. We've been, we jammed out to this like a couple years back. We'll play it back to back to back to back to back. Esta se la sabe? Completita, right? I don't think so. Let's see the next song. It's the next song is kind of old school. And again, it takes me back to once upon a time when <laughs> be out there como loca right it's kind of a lovey dovey song but just what it says and the way this guy sings it makes me feel like he's really feeling this song. a poco me la dedicas si sí, mi amor oh, vamos muy bien. okay <laughs> Alright guys, this one right here lately has become a carne asada classic, a song that is played at every party. Wait, wait, party. can I tell them a little bit about this song? Yeah, yeah, go ahead, go ahead. So this song is played at every party, mainly all my family's party because they love this guy, right? But the funny thing about this is that my dad is super, super old school Mexicano, so he did not, did not appreciate the new generation of banda the new trap corridos he was not having it right he like it before when we were younger obviously the adults managed the playlist but now that we grew up we'll be like no 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 it's our turn it's our turn so we're we're always jamming out to these songs and now my dad my dad even went to a hattie bill to go oh, see yeah, him yeah, with us, us. <laughs> without my mom this is how much my dad's a fan and um yeah let's do it all right the next song may he rest in peace is from a guy that i used to be a hardcore fan i would always listen to him even if we were just outside doing nothing just chilling drinking in the backyard we were jamming out to this guy Thankfully, I got a chance to meet him and see him live in concert before Lo Mataron. But regardless, this was one of my favorite songs that he has. Ready? This one right here is a, I keep saying this, but it's just a modern classic. If you've been on YouTube, you had to listen to this song. Wait, wait, another song that my dad is always requesting oh, yeah, now, yeah, and it's yeah. the new time. My, bye, if you're watching this. This one's for you. Yeah, this is for you. If you like banda and you're about that rancho life, you're about that going to the fiestas out there life, then you know these songs are get lit type of songs. You ready? ready. Back to back. We're going to put it back to back, back to back. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. 
today i hope you guys enjoyed this mexican lit playlist from lillian bay also we will be putting these in our guadis brand vibes new playlist that we will be updating very very soon i'm hoping by the time you guys see this it will be down low in the description if not stay tuned on at guadis brand on our instagram and we will be sharing the link there very very soon with all these songs plus some more not only mexican playlists but a little bit of everything that we get lit to right yep yep and don't forget to join the 100 dollars guadis merch giveaway down below all you got to do is like subscribe and comment down below what your favorite parts of this or what your favorite song from this vlog was and if you want some extra little cool points share this on any of your social medias just so you know show some love so anyways guys thank you guys for joining see you guys next time bye